I agree. I don't really find much value on the Eagles right now, despite their Super Bowl odds moving from 18 to 1 to 16 to 1. This was a really good trade for Saquon. I don't think it's necessarily the best thing for the Philadelphia Eagles. It's a lot of money for a guy that's entering his seventh season. And yes, the last two seasons he's been okay, but he has a lot of health question marks as well. I mean, he missed three games last year with an ankle injury as well. Now, it is good for Saquon also because, I mean, the Eagles had the six most rushing attempts in the league, the eighth most in rushing yards, but a couple concerns, like I just mentioned, the age of Saquon Barkley, as well as you talk about the chemistry, that's a huge thing for this team, and especially the defense. Like, are we going to figure out the secondary, who is 31st and passing yards allowed per sure game? Bradbury <laughs> so, <get> back nicely. <laughs> there's other question marks around the Eagles that I'd rather be have those answered before I'm yeah. thinking about betting on them. I'll say this about your Eagles. You make great points about how alarming their fall off at the end of the year was last year, but more so than not liking the Eagles, I really want to fade the Cowboys. They haven't done anything so far. At least the Eagles have signed someone well, like Saquon. Still a good team, that's why I, they haven't done much. But. 100. I think they're a good team, but we know in this NFC East, there's not a lot of repeating that goes on, and the Eagles are still the biggest threat on paper. And they've at least tried something here with Saquon Barkley, who is a difference maker when healthy. So. In fading the Cowboys, this makes me look a little closer at wanting to go to the next best option on the test, being the Eagles, though I do need to make sure that everything is in order in Nick Sirianni's house because it didn't look that way at the end of last I mean, season. How often does the season start with a Super Bowl contender who has a coach on the hot seat? Yeah.